Hi friends, happy Independence Day. Um, I just got back from the mall and I couldn't wait to share this with you guys. So I sat down and I told myself I need to tell this to the world. Okay, so quickly, I don't want to take up too much of your time, but I wanted to show you this amazing new um, palette that I got. It's um, from Cargo and it brings a highlight cheek and contour and you guys are going to love this. Um, I'm going to do it a little bit on my face even though um, I have on from when I was trying it on at the store and I'm going to use my MAC 120 and half the times I won't mention what brush I'm using because I really don't know um, I just know which one I'm supposed to use and I'm sorry about that um, but I will order um, my Sigma brushes soon and I'll be able to tell you guys what number it is and which one so you can be more aware um, okay so we'll start with the contour right here and again this is um, by Cargo and it is so so amazing and this is perfect for your everyday to go you know you don't have to be uh, rushing and getting um, three different things out of your um, makeup um, thing <laughs> and this is just one for all three to go and it's small it's compact it's perfect it fits anywhere I'm in love with it um, anyway <sighs> moving forward okay so next we're going to do the highlight and we're going to and again you can use the same brush for all of them and right when you highlight you want to highlight every part um, that has your bones um, so that your uh, bone structure can um, be more like baba boom you know and if you have high cheekbones or anything it'll be perfect for that and then um, we'll finish up with some cheek and we'll do just a little bit right here um, so that way it gets it and check it out guys beautiful um, I love it because it's very natural which is what I'm always looking for I don't look I don't like to look like I just stepped out of a nightclub at 8 o'clock in the morning um, I love the natural looks so it's perfect for me I am loving it and best of all it is all natural no parabens and if you want to know more about parabens please check out my blog www.jadorlid.com uh, next up um, I want to share with you something that I had bought last week, but I still I'm so crazy about it and it is the Benefit Sugar Bomb Blush and I love it. I think it's perfect for all skin tones and you know, it's got the perfect uh, sh uh, shimmer, um, especially now for the summer. It's amazing and it brings a little brush, which is perfect. And I know I just applied um, the cargo one, but I want to show you guys maybe see difference I'll kind of highlight my cheek um, you know I don't know if you can see it it's very bad lighting but take my word for it it is amazing it looks so pretty on it's got the perfect shades and I'll show it to you guys so that you can see it yourself it's got shades of pink and peach a little bit of it looks gray but it's really brown <laughs> um, so when you mix all four of them together, it is a sugar bomb. Next up, I want to show what I bought today. And I usually, I'm a fan of the Pink Pot by MAC, right here. And I use Soft Ochre, which is kind of like a yellowy um, pigment. Um, and it's very matte. And it kind of just, you know, it's... It's just very bland when you put it on your eyes. This is, of course, for your eyes, right over here. And I use it uh, to put my eyeshadows over. But today I decided to give something else a shot. I decided to buy the Too Faced Candlelight uh, Shadow Insurance. And um, I kind of loved it, <laughs> I must say. So here we go. I'll show it to you guys how it looks, and we'll do we'll try a um a shadow from Mac that I bought today as well. So let's give it a shot, and we'll do it right on top of the one from Mac, so that you can see the difference. And believe me, the difference is huge. Do you see it? This is Too Faced. This is Mac. Too Faced is glowing. Mac is not. <laughs> So what we'll do is that we'll use a reference right here. And I bought um, my two favorite shadows from MAC, which are Tempting and Woodwinked. And I love these two. They go amazing together. I use um, Tempting right over here. I'm sorry. I use Tempting on my crease, and I use Woodwinked all around my eye. And then I use uh, 
sandpaper um, to just highlight the top right over here. Other than that, I use my Naked palette from Urban Decay and it works just fine. Um, but these two are my little lovelies. So we'll get a little bit of woodwinked. This is woodwinked. Very bright. And we'll put a little bit on MAC and a little bit on Urban Decay. I mean, Too Faced. So, as you can see, one is more shiny than the other. This was MAC. And Urban Decay is right over here. It's a really, really bright one. All right. So it's just different. Um, it depends on what you want. If you want it, if you want your colors to look very matte and um, just solid, then I go with uh, the Paint Pot in Soft Ochre. This is a, a general one. They always have it. It's not, I don't like getting special editions because then I become attached to it and then they run out and then I'm sad. So I go with this one. It's perfect. Um, they always, it's available everywhere, every Mac and it looks great. I actually have it on today so you guys can see how my shadows are looking with it on and it, it works perfect. I've used it for years. Alright, next up. So I'm not going to apply this one but I wanted to show it to you guys. This is the Buxom Big and Healthy Lipstick in London London which I love I love London <laughs> all right so this is how it looks like and it's very pinky um, and it's so so pretty um, as you can see we'll put it right over here it's like a little pinky color and I like to wear it with you can wear it with anything I'm just kidding really it's a beautiful color but I use the buxom big and healthy in the color shade of, um, I know it, Destiny. See, I don't have to look. I already know them because I love them so much. Okay, and I use it on top, and it makes the pink look like a coral. And as you may have noticed, I love the shades of corals and pinks and everything on my face. It reminds me of summer. Um, I live in a very uh, tropical place, you can say, and it's always summer around here, and I love it. Um, it goes great with everything I wear, every look, um, and I'm always tan, so it works out. I do want to, I will apply the one that I did buy today, which is, this was the last one they had. I was like, yes, I want it, please. Um, this is the... Strange Potion from the new MAC collection, and if you were a fan of the Heather correct collection, um, the Sock Cop one, which I was, but then they ran out, of course, and now it's like for $60 at eBay, which I will not buy, um, but this is very similar to it, and I will apply it so you guys can see it. It's very pretty. It's another coral peachy color, but it looks amazing on. And I had it on, but I took it off just to show you guys how pretty it looks right when you apply it and it lasts the whole time see it's so pretty I'm in love with it I think this is going to be my everyday go-to gloss um, of course these two are still my it girls but I have to say they have serious competition now I've been trying to give the oranges a try um, I want to give it a shot, but because I'm so tanned, I look like something out of the Jersey Shore. So, no offense to Jersey people, this has nothing to do with you. This is nothing to do with Snooki and friends. Um, so, I couldn't do the orange look. It just didn't look good on me. Um, I love how red looks on me, how peach looks on me, but orange is just too loud. And I even asked like one of the girls from Mac, and I was like, is it just me or does it look too loud? And she goes, yeah, you know, you're, you're really tiny. It looks beautiful, but if this you're not used to it, you know, you'll never be used to it. So, um, I went with something more subtle. Um, it's still kind of different. It's a darker color. It's called Up the Amp, and I'm loving it. It's like a magenta fuchsia color. And I'm taking out all the wrong ones on the floor. If you see my mess right now, you'd laugh. Here it is. Up the amp. Okay. You guys are going to love this. And I recommend this to all my girly girls. It's such a pretty color. Look at it. It's like a purple fuchsia. And you can wear it during the day. And you can wear it at night. It's perfect. I'm telling you. It's amazing. Um, another color that I'm loving. And this is my everyday, um, you know lipstick 
and it's called Sea Shear from MAC. And it's that little peach one that you see right there. There we go. That's Sea Shear. And I wear it so pretty. And I wear it um, with my Buxom, the Destiny one. It looks awesome. Kind of looks like this, but a little more like bright and shiny. Um, and I'm sorry, I didn't show you guys the up the alt one. This is it. Very pretty. I can't wait to wear it. As soon as I wear it, I'll make a video with it on so you guys can see it. Um, so I believe this is it for me. Um, this is all I got um, as far as recently and today, and I wanted to share with you guys. So I hope you like the video, and check out my blog. I definitely talk about all these things, and I will be writing one um, regarding it today. So be on the lookout for that one, and my blog is www.jadorlive.com, and I can't wait to hear um, what you guys have to say, and please, please share with me um, any ideas that you guys might want. Um, maybe you uh, like a certain gloss or like a certain um, eyeshadow, and let me know. I'm always open to ideas and I'm always going and buying new things and trying them out so let me know what you like and I'll definitely check that out. Thank you and have a wonderful 4th of July. Bye!